Hey guys, welcome to our channel, A Smarter House, your permanent solution for all your smart home queries and problems. First of all, thanks for your amazing response to the last video where we discussed smart home automation. So, we planned to treat you with a whole series where we'll cover separate rooms and provide you with an ultimate smart automation guide. In today's video, we'll build the ultimate smart bedroom. So, without wasting any time, let's get started. You can set up a lot of scenarios and automation in your bedroom. We're going to take a look at the coolest and most convenient ones, and also guide you through the gadgets you need to play it out. This will of course depend on what ecosystem you're running, but you can make it happen on most of them. For a basic bedroom, you're going to need three motion sensors, and I'll recommend an Aquaria motion sensor. Get two Zigbee LED strips. Strips from Philips Hue will be great. You'll need a Zigbee and Z-Wave dimmer for ceiling lights. Fabario dimmer 2 will work fine, or you can even use smart bulbs. You'll need a smart blind. You can choose one by watching our last video according to your needs. For this setup, IKEA Zigbee blinds will be perfect. Now, let's set everything up. Place one motion sensor in a corner in the ceiling to cover the whole room. Place the other two motion sensors on the floor on each side of the bed. Now. Arrange two LED strips underneath each side of the bed. Your basic setup is complete. First thing in the morning, the motion sensor in the ceiling turns on the ceiling light and both LED strips on movement. The sensor will turn it off when nobody is present in the room. As you get back in the bedroom by evening, the motion sensor in the ceiling turns on the ceiling light and both LED strips at 40% intensity. Remember, this requires a dimmer for controlled lighting. You can check the previous video for detailed information. Now when it's nighttime, you can set a time for when you or the missus gets out of bed, and the motion sensor on your side of the bed will turn on the LED strip only on your side of the bed. It makes it easy for you to use without waking up your better half. You have your phone connected to your smart ecosystem, and it triggers this next automation based on when you're setting your alarm clock. For example, if your alarm is set to 7 a.m., at 6.30 a.m., the ceiling light and LED strips will start to dim from 0% to 100% within 30 minutes. And at 6.55, the IKEA blinds will open up. This will help your body and mind massively to get a softer wake up and you'll feel much fresher. If you decide to switch out one of the motion sensors to a multi-sensor like Fabario Multisensory, you can also easily set up the IKEA blinds to go up and down depending on temperature or how bright it is in the room. This will also save you energy on heating or cooling. It's also smart to set up some door and window sensors that could tell your AC or heating system that a window is open, so it's no point to try and heat the room. This is also great for security, in case you forgot to close a window when leaving the house. A lot of people also have a TV in their bedroom. How annoying is it when the sun shines on the TV? Have the IKEA blinds automatically go down and dim the lights when you turn your TV on. This could easily be done with the Zigbee or Z-Wave socket with energy measurement. For example, if the TV socket uses more than 15 watts, when the TV is on, the blinds should go down. When the usage goes down to zero watts, the TV is off and the blinds can go back up. So that's it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed watching the video. Subscribe to the channel for more smart and useful content. I'll be back with more crazy smart home solutions soon. Till then, keep exploring.